Yo, what's up, family? Happy Sunday to you guys. Today I'm going to read to you um, out of the book of Isaiah, chapter 65, family, verses 1 through 13. All people will learn about God. I help people who had not come to me for advice. Those who found me were not looking for me. I spoke to a nation that does not use my name. I said, here I am, here I am. All day long I stood ready to accept those who turned against me, but they kept doing whatever they wanted to do, and all they did was wrong. They kept doing these things right in front of me. That makes me angry. They offer sacrifices and burn incense in their special gardens. They sit among the graves waiting to get messages from the dead. They eat the, the meat of pigs, and their pots are full of soup made from unclean meat. But they tell others, don't come near me, don't touch me, because I am holy. They are like smoke in my eyes, and their fire burns all the time. Look, here is a letter that lists all your sins. I will not be quiet until I pay you back for these sins. I will do it by punishing you. I, the Lord, am doing this because of your sins and the sins of your ancestors. They did the sins they, when they burned the incense in the mountains. They shamed me on those hills, and I will punish them first. The Lord says... When there is a new wine in the grapes, people squeeze out the wine. But they don't completely destroy the grapes because the grapes can still be used. I will do the same things to my servants. I will not destroy them completely. I will give them some of the people of Jacob, some of the people of Judah to will get to my mountains. I will choose the people who will get the land. My servants will live there. Then Sharon Valley will be a field for sheep. The Valley of Anchor will be a place for cattle to rest. All this will be for my people and for the people who come to me for help. But you people left the Lord, so you will be punished. You forgot about my holy mountain. You became to worship luck. You held feast for a false god, fate. But I decided what would happen to you. You would be killed with a sword. You would be killed because I called to you, but you refused to answer me. I spoke to you, but you would not listen. You did what I said. You did what I said is evil and chose to do what I did not like. So this is what the Lord God says. My servants will eat, but you evil people will be hungry. My servants will drink, but you will be thirsty. My servants will be happy, but you will suffer shame.